the final non-conference series for the number nine Ole Miss Rebels. They'll play game one of a doubleheader here against Eastern Illinois on Friday afternoon. The sophomore from Jackson, Tennessee, freshman All-American a season ago, preseason All-American this year. He's two and one on the season with an ERA of 2.16. Strike three, Ryan Rollison gets out number two, blows by the senior parks. Back-to-back -back strikeouts to end the inning. Ryan Rollison gets out of an early jam here. Top of the order, do up for the Rams. Kessinger, Olenek, and Fortez. First pitch swing, Kessinger ground ball to short. Curran throws high and... All right, correction on that. Greg Kessinger, an error on that. Lots of room to run for the right fielder, Perone. And the ball from Olenek just kept sinking and seeking. He'll be aboard. Stevenson fires the 1-1 delivery. It's ripped right up into center field. Kessinger rounding third. The throw will be cut off, and there will be no challenge at the plate. Rebels lead it 1-0 early on. Late. Leave there for Olenek to throw down from the catcher, Smith. Payoff pitch from Stevenson. Inside, ball four, bases loaded for the Rebels. 1-1 one, one delivery. It's going to be lined out towards right field. Perone will make the grab. Olenek charging towards the plate. He'll score, and the Rebels take a 2-0 lead. Fly ball to center field, will score another Rebel. Two sack flies for Ole Miss, they lead it 3-0. Line shot's gonna find space in the gap. Dillard being waved from third. Throw won't come in, 4-0 Ole Miss. Give him another strikeout, Ryan Rollison finding his groove. Junior college transfer Jacob Adams will get things going in the bottom of the second. And he smokes this one. First pitch he sees. Jacob Adams. See ya. What were you saying about the not so usual home run hitters? Another strikeout for Ryan Rollison. Three up, three down for the Panthers. The Rebels bring Dillard, Golson, and Cockrell to the plate. He's going to smoke one out towards right center field. Thomas Dillard, stay hot. The second home run of the afternoon for Ole Miss. And it's Thomas Dillard making it a 6-0 ball game. Well, Thomas Dillard flexing his muscles as well. That ball was hit a ton. Another ball that went obviously blowing out but had no effect on that ball was absolutely crushed. Bases stay loaded with two outs. That one right back up the middle. First pitch swinging was Curran. One run scores. The second one coming home as well. EIU with a two run single. And he'll sit him down again looking. 2-1 offering as Dillard takes off for third. It's a hit and run. Off the knee of the shortstop, Curran. And Dillard is run number seven of the afternoon for Ole Miss. As Ryan Rollison sits down his sixth opponent of the afternoon. The Cape Cod League and what he was able to do. Holy smokes, what a play. New pitcher for Ole Miss, the junior college transfer, Austin Miller, six foot seven, 210 pounds. Talk about a big boy. 2 2 delivery from Miller. Gets him striking out. His fifth strikeout of the season. 1 2 pitch from Austin Miller. Outside corner, he struck out the first two batters he's seen. Went 0 for 3 in the series. And he's sitting down here again. Austin Miller strikes out the side in his inning. Rebels lead at 7-2, heading to the bottom of the eighth inning. 
line shot out to right. Ryan Olenek trying to track it down. He gets there in time. That's out number three. The Rebels pick up win number 13. Thomas Dillard, Jacob, Ad Jacob Adams with his first home run of the year.